Another common type of signal is a transient signal. So transient signals are usually signals that happen once or infrequently or you know, kind of aperiodically. So an example of a transient signal could be if I tap the microphone. You can see there I armed the oscilloscope, I tapped it, and then the waveform appeared on there. And, you know, the transient nature is, well, the signal is mostly zero, then all of a sudden there's this big, you know, displacement, and then it goes back to zero again. And, you know, similarly here, I could change my time scale a little bit, move things around. You could see here we have a large peak. That was probably the initial tap. And then, you know, 50, or 10 milliseconds later, let's move this over here. There's another small little tap that could be maybe the, when I tapped the microphone, the pencil might have bounced. And so it bounced after 10 milliseconds. And then you could see there's a sinusoidal signal in there. And maybe that was the actual, you know, vibrations that we induced by tapping this metal frame. And the period for those is, looks like approximately four milliseconds, right? We have two divisions right there. So you can see right here, we're just kind of giving this a qualitative you know, analysis. And you know, we could say that after, you know, if we move our, our first tapping instance over there, you know, after about say one, two, three, four time divisions of 20 milliseconds, the signal's gone. So that's kind of the transient nature of the signal. You know, there's nothing, it was quiet, signal came in, died away after 80 milliseconds, and then everything is quiet again. Oftentimes, transient signals have an exponential decaying sinusoid, something kind of like a ring. They can imagine like if you crash a cymbal, it's gonna ring down for a while where the initial hammer strike would be this large amplitude part. And then you could see these sinusoids that kind of look like they're being multiplied by a decaying exponential that eventually go away. And this is a, you know, a damped sinusoid probably saw this in, in circuits class, so this is common. So interesting thing about this, I could turn on my oscilloscope and trigger it. So you can see I'm hitting the, the microphone with the pencil, and the sine waves over here seem to have this very similar period. Like I could take a different thing and hit, hit it with that, or I could hit it with my finger. And notice those small sinusoids have the same pattern. So that's probably indicating that that vibration pattern is inherent in this microphone itself. It's not the hammer that we're using to hit it, it's the actual, oh, that's a nice one right there, that's a nice transient. You can see the exponential decay. But it's an actual material property you know, in this grill that's causing that to oscillate at that particular frequency.